Bhagavad Gita, first chapter, verses 8 to 9. In my army there are heroes like your good self, Drone Acharya, Grandfather Bhishma, Karna, Krip Acharya, who is ever victorious in battle, Ashvatama, Vikarna, Burishrava, the son of Somadatta, and Chayadrata, the king of Sindhu. There are many other heroes who are prepared to give up their lives for my sake. All are equipped with varieties of weapons and are expert in warfare. Sar Ardavarshini Here the word Somadatihi refers to Burishrava. Yakta Chivitaha denotes a person who is determined to do whatever is required of him, having properly realized that he will be greatly benefited, whether he survives or not. In the Gita 11.33, Bhagavan says, O Arjuna, all these persons have already been killed by me. You need only become an instrument. In accordance with this statement, Saraswati Devi made the word Yakta Chivitaha come from the mouth of Duryodhana, indicating that his army had already been destroyed. Sar Artavarshini Prakashika Riti Krip Acharya In the lineage of the great sage Gautama, there was a saint by the name Sharadvan. Once, after seeing the beautiful heavenly damsel Janapadi, his semen spontaneously fell on a clump of forest grass. This semen became divided in two parts, from which a boy and a girl were born. The girl was named Kripi and the boy Kripa. Kripa later became renowned as a great warrior. Sharadvan Rishi personally endowed Kripa with expertise in the science of archery and other arts. Kripa was exceedingly valiant and pious. In the battle of Mahabharata, he fought on the side of the Kauravas. After the battle, Maharaja Yudhishthira appointed him to train Prince Parikshit. Ashvatama Kripi, the sister of Krip Acharya, was married to Drona Acharya. From her womb, Ashvatama was born. Ashvatama was a combination of portions of Lord Shiva of the God of Death, Yama, and of Lust and Anger. He learned the scriptures and the science of weaponry from his father, Ron Acharya. He also accepted the responsibility of being the last commander-in-chief of the Kauravas in the battle of Mahabharata. He murdered the five sons of Draupadi while they were in deep sleep, having mistaken them for the five Pandavas. In retaliation, the Pandavas insulted him severely and forcibly removed a jewel that was a part of his forehead. After this insult, he burned with anger and attempted to kill the unborn Parikshit Maharaja, who was the sole heir to the Pandava dynasty. He targeted his Brahmastra weapon at the child in the womb of Uttara, the wife of Abhimanyu. However, Bhagavan Sri Krishna, who is always affectionate to his devotees, invoked his weapon named Sudarshana Chakra to protect Maharaja Parikshit in the womb. Vikarna Vikarna was one of the 100 sons of Dhritarashtra. He was killed by Bhimasena, in the Mahabharata war. Somadatta Somadatta was the son of Balika, 
and the grandson of King Pratika of the Kuru dynasty. In the battle of Mahabharata, he was killed by Satyaki. Burishrava Burishrava was the son of King Somadatta in the dynasty of the moon, Chandra Bamsha. He was a highly courageous and famous king. In the Mahabharata conflict, he was killed by Satyaki. Shastra This refers to a weapon such as a sword that is used to kill another in hand-to-hand combat. Astra, a weapon such as an arrow that is released at the enemy.